The Pythagorean Theorem There are literally hundreds of different proofs of this famous property of right triangles, but the following is definitely one of the slickest. Start with any right triangle with side lengths A, B, and C, where C is the hypotenuse length. We know that the two non-right angles in this triangle add up to 90 degrees. We'll use this fact later. Now create three different scaled versions of this triangle. One by multiplying all of its side lengths by A. Another by multiplying all of the original side lengths by B. And the last by multiplying all of the original side lengths by C. Notice that since the corresponding side lengths of these four triangles are proportional, they all have the same shape, but not necessarily the same size. That is, they are similar triangles and thus their corresponding angles are equal. Now let's take a look at the triangle that has a hypotenuse length of C squared. Notice that the other sides of this triangle have lengths of AC and BC which are also the hypotenuse lengths of our other two scaled triangles. As a result, we can perform a series of translations, rotations, and reflections on the three scaled triangles to create what appears to be a rectangle. We can confirm that this is indeed a rectangle by noting that we have a pair of opposite sides with equal length AB and a right angle at each of the four corners. Recall that the two acute angles in our triangles add to 90 degrees. Since we have a rectangle here, we know that the other two sides also have equal length. That is, our side length of C squared is equal to our side length of whatever A squared plus B squared is. In other words, A squared plus B squared equals C squared, thus proving the Pythagorean theorem. Although we don't know who originally came up with this approach to proving the Pythagorean Theorem, I can tell you that I was introduced to it in the books Math History and Proofs by Jay Cummings. If you haven't already, I highly recommend you check out these two top-shelf books by my favorite author. You can find these books, along with his Real Analysis book, for a great price on Amazon. You can also check out his website at longformmath.com.